Wow! My head really itches. Nurse, can you explain? Well, we did find a fair amount of macroinvertebrates. One species in group 3, three species in group 2, and two species in group 1. You had an index score of 15. So, how are you feeling today? What happened? How? How did I get here? We found you in Penberville, Ohio. The land is used for agriculture and human living space. You were just floating downstream in the middle. You didn't look very good, so we brought you in and performed some parameters. Why was I there? You were out fishing on a partly cloudy day. The river was about 13.5 degrees Celsius. The air was cool at 55 degrees Fahrenheit. I sure do have a knack for picking the perfect fishing weather. I guess this time I was a little off. Sadly, yes. You're lucky that it wasn't deep, only about 14 inches, or you would have drowned. I am going to consult with the doctor. You should be fine for a second. We will talk about more results later. Doctor, I am having some trouble diagnosing this patient. Can you help? Sure. Where is his chart? Right there on the table. All right then. Let's take a look. Temperature, nitrates, and phosphates were all excellent, ranging from 90 to 95. Dio had a Q value of 94, so he is not short on dissolved oxygen. Only a few poor results. Well, it looks like sure five signs of H2O cis. Low Q values for fecal coliform, EOD, and total solids parameters. We better go check on the patient. Oh no! The patient. Doctor, come quick. What in the world is going on? He has flatlined. Get the defibrillator. Okay. Be right back. He better hurry up. We are not losing this patient. There you are. Finally. I had some trouble finding what we needed. I will hook him up and give him a shock. I must shock him again. This isn't working. Boom! I passed out again. This time, I saw flashbacks of what was happening it's all coming back to me. Go get my brother and tell him I am okay. I'll handle it. Family of Rip reportage. I have word of his condition. How is he? Is it bad? Don't sugarcoat it. He is doing fine. We have good levels for pH and turbidity. We are highly concerned about his Q values for total salads, BOD, and fecal coliform. Do you want to see him? Yes, yes. Let's go. Wait up. Hey, how are you doing? He's great. The doctor will be in soon to give him treatment for his H2O cis. He will talk with you about the impacts of this disease. See you later. Hello, Mr. Portage. I am here to give you a shot to help control your H2O cis. Now this won't hurt a bit. I have never heard of H2O cis. What are some of the impacts? Follow me into the hall so I can explain. His low levels are total solids, BOD, and fecal coliform. His total solids score will impact water clarity, reduce photosynthesis, and may cause the water to become toxic. His fecal coliform can increase the chance of pathogenic organisms causing illness. The low BOD will reduce the variety of organisms in the river. Can he go home? Yes. Just watch him carefully for any worsening symptoms. Great. Thank you, doctor. I bet it feels great to be out of that bed. Oh, no. Here we go again.